Tracy Vrem, uh, Linda and I own and operate Blue Mountain Lodge. It's uh, based 60 miles south of King Salmon on the Alaska Peninsula. Uh, this is probably about my 27th year of running the operation. We do both uh, fly out fishing and hunting. We have a small operation. I run four airplanes for six guests, two Cessnas, one on wheels and one on floats, and a couple of Super Cubs, one on floats and one on wheels. I think what's different about us is uh, we're a smaller operation. We cater to a maximum of six guests at a time, and I've, I'll do as little as a single person, take them out fishing, or plug them into a group that maybe there's room. We do a lot of our fishing uh, where no other lodges get to. We, we take the extra time to put you into smaller airplanes, to get you out to these remote streams that, that nobody fishes but our guests. And so I think we're pretty unique in that fact. It's, it's uh, not one of the big lodges where there's 20 or 30 guests or even a dozen, and they put you in a beaver and, and you kind of have to go only where those airplanes can access it. And by utilizing the wheel planes and then the smaller Super Cub, we can get into a lot of places where nobody else fishes. This is one of our favorite spots to come on the Pacific side. Uh, never see any other lodge here. We have fantastic fishing. Uh, don't see a lot of other people. I keep going on about that, but I think that does, is what makes us unique. We offer uh, all five species of salmon, of the Pacific salmon, rainbow trout, Arctic char, Dolly Varden, and grayling, occasional lake trout, and occasional northern pike. Our strongest suit is probably arctic char and grayling but we have some very good rainbow fishing they're all river rainbows so uh, a great big rain rainbow for us is about eight pounds and he's spent his entire life in a small river people bring their spinning gear because we're uh, the fishing so good so they can have success so they can put down their spinning rod and try a fly rod and end up catching some fish and then they decide you know i, I kind of like this so over the years, we've converted what we say a lot of people from the dark side, from chunk and hardware, to f fly fishing. But that's not to belittle any uh, hardware fishermen. We gladly take you, and, and we have a lot of fun. Starting August 10th, we have ptarmigan hunting. And the ptarmigan, it's pretty unique out of our lodge because we're on old oil exploration roads. And these roads are only accessible by air, and, and over the years, I've had vehicles flown in to the lodge and and so there's about 25 to 40 miles of road that we can access. Met a lot of really nice people over the years and, and formed some really strong friendships and, and that's probably one of the better parts of this job other than being out in this this stuff day after day. It's beautiful country in Alaska. Uh, we don't see a lot of other people. See a lot of different wildlife, whether it be from just small birds to, to big brown bears and moose. Our lodge is, uh, is newly constructed. We have it set up for six people at a time, so it, it's kind of a, oh, more of a quaint atmosphere, I guess. You, you, you can, it's small enough to where it's usually pretty easy to come up with a group of three or, or a group of six of your buddies or husband and wife. So we get a lot of couples. and. It's small enough, you, you know, you, you don't have to worry about being around other people you don't know or, or you can just be yourself. Hi, I'm Linda Vrem and I'm south of King Salmon at Blue Mountain Lodge in Alaska. We're having a beautiful day today. I'm the cook and also Tracy's wife. Uh, our repeat customers have actually really helped grow our business and we were able to build a, a brand new main facility. About four years ago, we built uh, duplex guest cabins, and um, last summer, Tracy and some of our guides and a contractor built a brand new main lodge, which we just love. It's um, warm and dry, comfortable. Uh, I have a commercial style kitchen. I really appreciate that. We have wonderful repeat customers, and I'm hoping that's a sign that we're doing a good job. It makes it a lot more fun when we uh, recognize familiar faces and enjoy their company. What I like about it is they've watched our kids grow up. So they've been here from when our son was had to get off of the four-wheeler to shift it by hand and then climb back up and give it throttle. To, uh, they're just going to miss him coming down in the Super Cub on floats. Well, I've been 
coming up here for a long time. I started coming to Alaska in 89 and fished any number of different places over the years. But a good friend of mine enticed me to come and stay at Blue Mountain Lodge, I think back in 2003, if I remember correctly. And it just fits the bill for everything that I'd like to do up here. And I think one of the nice things is the variety of fishing. You can fish for kings or maybe silvers, depending upon the time of year, or, or reds or what have you. But you don't do that every day. You, you fly over to the Pacific and fish for dollies and some chums, perhaps, or some fresh run silvers. And the next day you're in a small backcountry uh, stream fishing for huge uh, grayling. Yesterday I think I had three grayling over three pounds. I've never caught grayling like that anywhere else in Alaska except here. I guess the other thing that is special about Blue Mountain Lodge is that it's a family owned and operated and it's run just like a big family almost. Uh, it's just the you can have Tracy Venn's uh, mom uh, in the past doing the cooking, or his wife Linda doing the cooking, and he's got his children helping out, his brothers helping to fly. It's just a very relaxed uh, and homey, warm atmosphere. So I, I just, this is the place for me to come whenever I come back to Alaska to fish. Well, this is my 11th season here at Blue Mountain Lodge. I started in 96 and uh, fished several other lodges in Alaska, and by far I think this is the most outstanding one. Tracy has a new lodge. The facilities are just wonderful, the food's wonderful, but most of all, the fishing is fantastic. A nice big rainbow. Nice. Yes. Every day is a new opportunity, flying to another location, so we never fish the same stream or river twice. You have an opportunity to catch seven species of fish here, from salmon, uh, dollies, growling, rainbows, and big dollies and, and uh, grayling are just the ticket. Finishing strong. Guido Maximus. And the organization is terrific. There's very little pressure on the fish, and if you like to fly fish and catch fish, this is the place to come. I wholeheartedly recommend it, and uh, I just think it's a wonderful opportunity if you like, if you enjoy fishing. I came to Blue Mountain Lodge the first time in 1994 with my sons, and I think the what I really, really liked about it was the family atmosphere with Tracy and Linda and mom and dad here and <clears throat> just made everybody feel welcome. And then certainly the, the fact that I caught more fish than I've ever thought possible for one man to catch in the five day period. And <clears throat> we just had a ball. So we've come back four or five times and I've told my friends about them <clears throat> and they've come back and they've told friends about the place. And so uh, if you are coming to Alaska and you wanna catch fish, a bunch of fish. This is the place you need to consider because they're the nicest people in the world and they give you what you need and they and every nickel that you spend is worth it. I've been coming to Blue Mountain Lodge uh, since July of 1995 and I can honestly say that this is the greatest place on earth. Not only is the fishing a world-class area around here of catching numerous fish, sometimes catch up to and over a hundred fish a day but the hospitality of the people here at the lodge it, are outstanding they will do anything to help you on your trip and Tracy is knowledgeable about everything and this is just the greatest place that I've ever been to and I cannot cannot wait to take my children here like my dad has taken me here for the past three times I have been uh, visiting Blue Mountain Lodge for the last seven years Every year it's been a different experience. Uh, the weather changes from time to time, but the fishing is always fantastic. The hosts of this place are absolutely phenomenal. The cooking is great. Unfortunately, I do gain weight, but the fish don't. 
I wear them out, they wear me out. It's a mutual experience.